days shutting me out. You show up on my couch. Ready to have a heart to heart? I think it's a little too late, Jason. I made my choice, you made yours. There's nothing left to say to each other. I found the man from the park. And I know you paid them to threaten Elizabeth and my son. Do you think I wouldn't find out? Those men were paid to scare Elizabeth, not hurt her. They pulled a gun. The cops would have shown up. Who knows what could have happened? Cam and Jay could have been caught in the crossfire. I was there to make sure that didn't happen, Jason. So the way I see it, I did you a favor by staging that incident in the park. Elizabeth got a wake-up call before it's too late. So instead of standing here confronting me, you should be thanking me for saving your son from the real danger. Which would be you? If you hurt them again in any way, I will kill you. Crowded around here if the cops have got to double up on two total strangers, huh? Yeah, I don't think it's a mistake. Why not? So you're hoping to get something out of it? Your testimony against me? Oh, I might be willing if I had any idea who you are. I'm Sam. Sam McCall. I'm in for eating and abetting Sonny Corinthos. Jason Morgan. Me too. I know. She was your friend, but you, you need to step back. We have to protect the crime scene from contamination. It's the only way we're going to catch this guy. But why Georgie shouldn't be left alone? Hey, listen. There's nothing you can do for her now. Well, that's not, that's not true. Many different belief systems believe that the spirit of the dead stays close by until it can gently pass into the spiritual realm. You don't know what I'm talking about. But she would. She. She was. Hey, get the kid out of here! What do we got? Scorpio, listen to me. Who is that? Commissioner, I'm sorry.
Is that George? Is that George? Is that my daughter? There's nothing left to do. Chief? Chief? Was she in an accident? I'm sorry. She was murdered. <laughs> Do you honestly think he's <clears throat> out of breaking his heart? No. But he realized that I was right. And eventually he's going to realize I'm right about you, too. I'm about to run your skanky butt out of town. So you take the money. Drop it! Oh. Oh. You all right? You can join my father now. Emily, where are you? I'm here, near the edge. Did you find Emily's body? Only this. It was on a branch close to the rocks. I looked all around, but there was no sign of her. It's, it's a couple hundred feet down. The water's ice cold. The current's way too strong. She has to be dead. Stay tuned for scenes from the next general hospital. Keeping a modicum of modesty. What are you clothes on? Sexy, why I asked you to procure me some new ones. Why don't you have any clothes on? An unfortunate set of circumstances to follow the Jackal P.I. I'm all ears. There's no need to elaborate, let's just say. Simple miscalculation. Okay. Um, but all is well now. As we are happily talking to a safe place of refuge. <laughs> 